The Weezer River is one of the few large Idaho rivers that remains undammed. Coursing through timbered forests, narrow canyons, rolling foothills, and the small farming towns of Council and Cambridge, the river enters the Snake River at Weezer. The Weezer Shoshone people came to the Weezer River for generations to fish for salmon and steelhead. The Weezer River is still popular for fishing and today's angler might land a trout or a bass. Whitewater rafting and canoeing, camping and bird watching, especially for birds of prey like bald eagles, draw people to the Weezer River. But the biggest attraction is the Weezer River Trail. At 84 magnificent miles long, the Weezer River Trail is Idaho's longest rails-to-trails non-motorized path. The Friends of the Weezer River Trail maintains the trail that is beloved by the local community and is a destination for tourists from around the United States. Landowners and state and federal agencies are investing millions of dollars and volunteers are donating thousands of hours to improve the water quality and fish and wildlife habitat along the Weezer River and its tributaries. Everyone benefits from a healthy, free-flowing river. One of the rarest native species living along the Weezer River is the Southern Idaho ground squirrel. The squirrel is so rare, it's a candidate for listing as an endangered species. A 300-foot high dam is proposed on the free-flowing Weezer River. The dam would flood farmland, block fish migration, bury the whitewater of the Galloway Canyon, destroy habitat for the bald eagles and other birds and wildlife, drown ground squirrels, and inundate more than 15 miles of the Weezer River Trail. More than 6,000 acres of productive land would be lost. The free-flowing Weezer River is no place for a dam. Learn more at IdahoRivers.org.